it is our pleasure to host this school in Nepal. And I thank you all, especially for those who have come all the way from different parts of the world to participate in this first batch, the Kuspalal batch of the Madan Bhandari School. And congratulate you all for the successful conclusion of the school of huge importance to develop the working class culture, to internalize the movement, to educate the cadres and leaders on Marxism, Leninism, and to socialize the militants of the movement. I am also happy to meet the 45 students from 14 countries all over the world, representing Argentina, Bangladesh, Brazil, East Timor, India, Thailand, Tunisia, Pakistan, Philippines, Sri Lanka, Zambia, Morocco, Tanzania, and Nepal. A special thanks goes to the organizing team and CPP of the school who honored people's leader, Comrade Madan Bhandari, and recognized his contribution in the communist movement of Nepal in particular and the communist movement all over the world in general. Building internationalism, the sharing and learning, success and challenges of the movement, and great and deeper understanding of scientific Marxism to prepare the cadres of our movement is more relevant than ever to fight against the challenge posed by imperialism and neoliberal capitalism. I hope that this magnificent effort is the initiation toward the meeting responsibility of our times. Dear comrades, I know that Madan Bhandari School of Asia is a political school, a working class school, initiated as a sister school of various global school, global school from Brazil, South Africa, by Nepal Communist Party and Workers Party of Bangladesh, where is the Communist Party of India, Marxist. I also expressed its support for this school. I think the pedagogy of this school, which involves theoretical training along with outdoor activities, militant works, base groups, meetings, presentations, sharing of experiences among the participants in order to enrich the comradely and cordiality that precisely exists to mitigate the contradiction between theory and practice was innovative and new practice through it is a continuous process. Really happy to meet, I am really happy to meet around 50 participants from across the globe, especially the young comrades. Happy to know about the participation of CPP from sister school in Brazil, South Africa, United States of America. Thank you all for naming this first course in the name of Comrade Kuspala Andres, founding general secretary of our party. Honoring his contribution not only here in Nepalese Communist Movement but also all over the world in an international communist movement. As I know, the contents of the course are relevant to the present time. Marxism, Leninism, more specifically historical and dialectical materialism, political economy, class, gender, race, caste, and religious, all movement and organization in South Asia are really relevant subject, comrades. The discourse of the time we live through are the reflection of the crony capitalism, a system of undermine, a system that undermines the nature, humanity and peace in its motives of profit. Neoliberal global capitalism has been more brutal to the people and hostile to the working class. Extreme nationalism fundamentalism, fascism has become the new face of new liberal, neoliberal hegemony. In this context, it, it was urgent, in this very context, it was really urgent to initiate the international process to reunite the working class struggle and launch ideological campaign, realizing the role of political education, what MPSA has done, it's really appreciating and I also want to congratulate all of you to taking this opportunity to create a new culture, to start, to initiate a new ideological campaign, campaign against imperialism and all reaction all over the world. Thank you very much.